I mean, we're gonna have to take drastic measures here because this guy is not stopping. There we go. There we go, there we go, box him in, box him in, oh my god. What is up, beautiful people of YouTube? My name is Juritastic, and I'm sorry it's been a while, I've been busy. Started my own business outside of YouTube, obviously. I mean, YouTube is not really my business. I barely make any money, man, I just do this because I have fun. I barely, I make like, off of these LSPDL4 videos, I probably make like $3 a month. But again, I just have fun with them, I like, do like entertaining you guys. Um, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get in this episode. Today we're patrolling the strawberry area. Uh, we got Captain 14's Impala. I love those Impalas. So I decided to go with this Impala. I should have got the guard bar on in the front, but it's all good. Hopefully not too many chases. Uh, so today we are going to be trolling the hood. We got the flat jacket on. And we are ready to go. Uh, I think this is episode number 12 or 11. I'm not sure because <laughs> I never keep track of it. But let's go ahead and uh, get it started, guys. Thank you very much for tuning in, and I hope you guys enjoy it. All right, dude. All right, another Punto, I think it's called. Just cut, literally cut me off. So we're going to pull him over and see what his deal is. Looks like it is occupied times one. This is what the interior on this one looks like. All of Captain 14's interior are great. Details are great. Except I feel like there's too much gray on the dash going on. Um, owner's license expired. All right, well, so we'll see what's up with that. We did war flag them to pull over. We'll just uh, signal them to pull over or flag them for a pullover. We signal them to pull over once this turns green, and it has turned green right now. Um, whoa, this dude is just on one today. All right. Yeah, just a little bit more for me, huh? Actually, no, I meant to do the mimic, not that. I guess that could work, too. Alright, don't run into the pole. Panto. Panto, that's what's it called. So, possible license expired. Let me just pull back here so people can stop trying to steal my car. Alright. Alright. Yep. So, yep. the reason I pulled you over today, you literally cut me off back there. You almost hit me, actually. So, uh, any reason for your aggressive driving? Have you been drinking at all today? Alright, David, hang on for me just a second. I'll be right back with you. So, his license is expired. With expired license, as always, I say this in every episode, I go based on the rules of the state that I live in and the rules of the state that I live in. If it is an expired license and the cop has enough reason to believe that you really were unaware of it, then they'll either give you a ticket or give you a warning or give you some time to go prove that you updated it. Now, a suspended license in the state that I live in is different. Suspended license, you automatically go to jail. Uh, besides that, he doesn't have any active warrants. Um, we'll see how cooperative he is with me. Um, I mean, if I really want to be a dick, I can just tow his car. All right. Um, do you have anything? You know, you never know. Sometimes people search my car. All right. Uh, Jesus shit. Let me go ahead and give him breathalyzer first. See what his deal is all about. I do want to, guys, thank you very much for tuning in to this episode. Uh, thank you for choosing Sherutastic for your LSPDF4 entertainment. Let me see. No thanks. All right. I'm going to go ahead and act uh, as for a canine unit. Usually, sh usually it's a shit show when you... Yeah, bro. Why am I not... Oh, I have to be in the car to do that. Yep. Uh, there's a canine unit. Hey, uh, just suspecting that he might have uh, some illegal stuff in his car. So if you want to go ahead and kind of take a look at that for me. I like that. Uh, unmarked Tahoe for the K9 car. All right, all right, all right. So here's a car, a dog doing his thing. Based on that, I mean, he's definitely getting a ticket because he's not being cooperative. And uh, if he gets his license reinstated or... Hmm, is the dog being excited or what? Is that supposed to mean anything? I'll wait for him. Is he coming back? Well, at least it's not being buggy. Sometimes it does get buggy. 
So any news? Dog got a hit, want me to hang out? No, you can go. You're already blocking traffic for me. Forgot his name. Alright, sir, I'm gonna ask you to step out the car for me here. And uh, you're not being arrested. Go ahead, make me but you are being detained for the time being until I conclude the search. I have a seat for me right here. Alright, let's go ahead and search the car. The dog could get a hit. You know, I wasn't gonna search a car, but the way he answered, he said, You never know, people sometimes borrow my car. And uh, he's not being cooperative at all, so hey, he wanted the canine dog, and uh, we got him one. Alright, so as far as the car is concerned, there was nothing found. Um, let's check him. Let's check him, see what's going on. Man, I do love this Impala. It is a very nice looking Impala. A suicide note, well... Um... I wish there was like a mental hospital I can check him in, but... I can't. So, in this case, uh, he will be released. Sometimes it bugs out when I try to release him. Alright, um, does this want to work? It will be released. Uh, hopefully, he can just go back in his car. Oh, that's, that's what happens, just walk away. Well, I'm not going to tow the car because the car is not... There was no reason, there's no reason for me to tow the car, but unfortunately, when you release him, sometimes they just walk away. So with that being said, nothing found on him. Not, nothing found in the car. There's no reason for me to arrest him. I would have given him a ticket if he actually went back in the car, but he didn't. So we'll just keep patrolling strawberry area, see what I can get into. I tell you what guys, as far as the calls are concerned, it's been pretty slow. I mean, I'm doing a lot of traffic stuff, but calls are definitely slow. Dispatch calling stolen police vehicle. Lincoln, yeah, we'll we take that. A in Davis. We'll go ahead and take that. Did I, yep, I responded to it. Alright, damn man. Move, 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 move. I right, should be right here. Oh We've shit! What the fuck? Here. We can take that if no one else wants it. Let's see. Get on the floor, get on the floor, get on the floor. Foot chase, foot chase, foot chase. Let's get another. Oh shit. In, Got way too uh, many backups. It's alright. Sir, get on the floor. All right. Stay right there. Stay right there. Do not move. Do not move. Get on the fucking floor. Oh, he kind of blocked himself in before we even got started. Now, what the hell are you thinking? Stealing a police car. Jay's no Williams. Units required. Well, well, I can't even spell Williams right now. Williams. <laughs> Let's see what the hell if he got anything. Yeah, he is wanted by the LSPD. Now, what the hell is that all about, man? That crazy. You steal a police car and then when I come, you run? You can't be doing none of that shit. What come, the hell? Come here for me. Come here. Look at those lights. Those lights do look pretty nice. Does look pretty nice. Well, I actually just set them right here and I uh, have a prisoner transport come. I think that cop car despawned. Yeah, I guess it did. Nothing found on him, but he'll be going to jail for, for what? Where the hell did he go? Man, those uh, those uh, uh prisoners or people getting tra despawned like civilians. I haven't seen that since like GTA 4, LCPD F4. All right, so successful, pretty nice stuff. Keep going on with our patrol. Citizens report a possible stolen vehicle in the Maybank Stadium. Vehicle fitted with tracker. Uh, I don't think I've had that one before. I don't know even know what that's supposed to mean. Am I supposed to go look for it once I get there? Alright, so guys, we got a vehicle fitted with tracker. I believe it's a stolen vehicle call. We're on our way right there right now. 
We're on our way right now. See what the hell's going on. What the fuck are you doing? Now that vehicle's not worthy to be on the road, but we got bigger fish to fry right now. All right, so single strength. Oh, I see. It's down there. All right, all right, all right, all right. Are we moving away from it? Yes, we are indeed. Or maybe the vehicle's going. Kind of have to go here till we find it. Damn. So vehicle. What the fuck? Where is this vehicle? Is it down there? Nope, definitely not this way. That is gonna be pretty interesting. We'll just keep. Is that it? No, that's just the cops chasing it. Oh shit, I'm sorry. We'll go ahead and turn the lights off for now until we figure out what the hell's going on. It's going this way. Three hours later. Yeah, is that it? Yo, that is it, yeah. It's that vintage vehicle right there. Uh, let's see if we can perform a traffic stop on it. Pull your damn vehicle over. I guess not. Alright, let's just go ahead and uh, since we're in a condensed area, let's just get our air support just in case we lose them because I don't want to go too crazy if they go crazy. Uh, yeah, 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 box them, box them, box them right there, right there. Stay right there. Oh my god, don't you fucking hate when they do that? Perfect boxing, then he moves the last second. Uh, we gotta keep chasing the vehicle. Just gotta give us some space. Nothing drastic or radical on his part so far, but... Okay, now we're, now we're taking speed. I mean, if he wants to crash, he can crash, but I'm not trying to crash myself. Dude, don't fucking hit me. What's the... It's unsafe right now. Oh man, oh man, <laughs> head into the Los Santos International Airport area. Definitely don't want him to go there, there's a lot of pedestrians there. This is going to be very interesting. Oh, I think he's about to get boxed in here. Please do not move the car. Holy shit, I was just ramming cars like he got a fucking tank. Oh great, that's great. That's great. It's always awesome when your own guys hit you. Well, currently we have uh, secondary. Because this guy, I don't want to try to... Oh my god, don't... F I have a fucking safe too, man. These guys are going crazy. And they're not even catching up to him. So I'm going to have to pull up a little bit here. Um, Can't really do a pit right now. The second best thing to do is kind of... Keep going after him. Keep this. I don't want to get too close at the same time. He pulls up speed and then. Oh! Alright. Well, I can't really. I'm not trying to really do a pit. I'm just trying to kind of put him off course here. Alright. Not happening. This car seems to be too heavy. Alright, we're still. Still in this pursuit. Maybe the bus is gonna box him in? No. I like how the bus, buses and uh, and uh, trucks don't even acknowledge your sirens at all, dude. Box them in, not me. Wow. Still haven't found the right opportunity to really box them in or or pit them. I mean, we can't pit them when he's going five miles an hour. Um, we almost had to box them in right at the beginning of the chase, but. Our smart ass cop friends decided to just not do that. So right now we're just kind of staying back a little bit, being careful. Um, Attention all units. He is just not pulling over at all. I have canceled a traffic stop. Well, it's not really a traffic stop right now. It's a pursuit. But while we are in this pursuit, guys, if you are enjoying the episode, please do hit that like button. And make sure you do subscribe. We reached 300 subscribers, guys. 300. That is a good milestone, yo. 
That is a pretty good. I don't know why 300 seems like a good milestone. You know, 300, and then there's a cop car right there. This guy is just like not doing shit. And now we're going the opposite way. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, can you please box him in? Somebody, anybody. Let's see. He's not going too fast here. Maybe we can get him out. Nope. We can't get him out. So yeah, man. 300 subscribers is a great milestone. It is Occupy Times 1. From what I can see. Um, we are going the opposite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go that way. That's great. Oh, shit. Maybe he's going to... Well, it's not going to open up for him. Oh, uh, what? I didn't open up for him. That's why I try to stay back because it'll open up for me. It maybe. There we go. There we go. That still didn't work. Well, we need more. Now it's getting dangerous, guys. Now it's getting to the point where we need to do something. He's right on the runway. What the fuck? What kind of car is this? He's just ramming motherfuckers over like that. It's getting a little out of hand. I'm gonna try to actually get out and shoot the tires if I have enough. Oh no, I can't. I don't want to endanger my fellow officers, but it is getting out of hand right now. We got five cop cars here and he's just driving around the airport. You know, I, I wonder in real life, I mean, if, if somebody did infiltrate the airport, would they try to shoot him to stop him? Man, I haven't seen a, a, a garbage truck in this game in a while. All right. Well, this is not ending anytime soon from what it seems like. Oh, my God. Can somebody please... Okay, we can, we're can. we going to have to go full-out aggressive. The problem with full-out aggressive is they end up being aggressive towards me. But we have enough cop cars here. I'm just kind of waiting for them to, whatever they do, hit him. Oh, okay, let me get a crack at hitting him. Oh, that was that was hitting him, not tipping him. All right, let's try it again. All right, comes the Dodge Charger. Give it a shot. Oh my God, this is literally the longest pursuit I've been on since my LSPDF4 career. All right, let's try it. Oh man, I mean we're gonna have to take drastic measures here because this guy is not stopping. There we go. There we go, there we go, box him in, box him in, oh my god, box him the fuck in. How hard is it, man? I'm trying to go right here and just block him, even though it's not really dangerous. I mean, it's not really safe. Oh shit, watch out for these two workers. Well, there's another thing that I can do right now. He's kind of cording himself in anyways. Alright, let's get him out. Let's get him out. Get on the floor, get on the floor, get on the floor. I might I might have to shoot him in his leg, I'm not gonna lie to you. Watch out. I might have to shoot him, he's he's an he's an authorized uh he, he's a... What the fuck? He just runs again. He's in an area where he shouldn't be. I don't know if the guy's armed or not, but he's He's relentless. He's in an area he should not be in. Get down. Yeah, hit this asshole. Get down on the fucking floor. He got shot twice, he kept running like nothing. A lot of you might criticize him, man, but put yourself in a real life situation. He goes in the airport, driving all over the airport in a very, very restricted area. And this guy just seems relentless. Kenneth Parkinson. So, what the hell's your deal, Kenneth? Kenneth. Parkinson. So he's not wanted. Let's let's search him. Assistance needed for a suspect placed under arrest in uh, Los Santos International. Adam Six, copy. We'll check it out. Hey. Roger. So he's not wanted. Nothing found on him. Um, we're gonna go ahead back to the car. I search him. But yeah, man. Like I said, a lot of you might say, "Well, that's not really realistic." But again. What would you do if you were a cop? You're on the chase. Uh, he put a few people's lives in danger. And he goes in a very, very, very restricted area. There's only so much you can do with that. 
I tried to shoot the tires earlier to kind of slow him down, but there was no slowing this guy down. So we'll go ahead and call it Tortoise Car. And with that being said, guys, you know what time it is. It is time to wrap and call it an episode. I really want to thank you very much for tuning in. I um, hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed it. This was a fun episode. Always a fun time in Los Santos in the strawberry area. Thanks so much. So thanks a lot, guys, and uh, hope to catch y'all in the next one. Enjoy your day.